What is up YouTube, IDM here and welcome back to another video. So I'm going to show you a really cool way you can lock the applications on your device on iOS 15. Now I did do a previous video on this where it basically would automate the lock screen so as soon as you uh, open an app it would kick you to the lock screen, uh, which that method does work but it's really kind of not fluent and it is really inconvenient for you, the person that you know wants to get into the application. And this new method I think is, is actually pretty awesome. Now, I wish Apple would make this a feature of iOS 15. I think it would be really cool to be able to natively lock these applications. But until then, this is the kind of workaround. So the first thing you guys wanna to do to be able to lock your applications is you go into settings and you can navigate down to accessibility and then navigate down to guided access. Make sure guided access is turned on. Also, go into passcode settings and make sure you enable face ID because having that enabled uh, makes this method a lot more fluent. You guys will see later here in the video, but make sure face ID is turned on as well. And you don't need to set up time limits or anything like that. Just basically just, you know, leave it as is. Just make sure it's on and you have face ID enabled. So now at this point, we can go into the shortcuts application and create the automation. So from here, we're just gonna click the plus button and create personal automation. And we're gonna choose app. So just choose app. And then we're going to choose which applications we want to lock. Now I'm just gonna do messages for demonstration purpose, but you can choose more than one application here. You could have you know, messages, phone, Facebook, Instagram, whatever you want, you can select as many applications as you want from this list. And then once you've done that, just click on done. And now we're gonna click on next. And the action we want to do is called start guided access. So just type out start and then scroll down a little and you can see there is start guided access. So go ahead and choose on that, uh, that option, click on next, and then make sure you turn off ask before running. That will defeat the purpose of it locking the application. So don't ask, make sure you turn that off and then click on done. So now we have created the automation. There's a little bit more to it though. So let's go ahead and exit out of the shortcuts app. And now when we try to launch messages, as you can see, guided access started. Now at this point, you will still be able to interact with the application. So what you wanna do is triple press the side button and then input the passcode that whatever you use to set it up. And then you wanna to go to options and toggle all of this off. Basically you're disabling the side button, the volume buttons, the motion, keyboards, touch, time limit, all of that. So just disable all of that. Um, you could leave, I guess, the side button enabled still so they could lock it <laughs> and just shut it off. But I like to disable everything because with it like this, if anyone tries to get into this application, basically your phone is going to be frozen on that app and then they're going to be guilty as charged. So that's why I like to do it. Just make sure you turn it all off and then click on resume. And once you've done that, you'll notice that when you launch messages or whatever app that you're locking, you can't do anything in the app. You can't go back, you can't lock the iPhone, you can't change the volume. You can see guided access is enabled, so you can't access control center, you can't exit the app, you can't do anything. So the average person is gonna, you know, pretty much be very confused at this point, uh, unless they know how guided access works and they can somehow guess your passcode or something. But What's cool here is with Face ID enabled for you, if you want to be able to use these apps, all you gotta do is double click the side button, point it at your face and you can use the app. So in action, the way this works is this app is technically locked. So as soon as it's launched, it goes into guided access and then you just double click the side button and then the uh, guided access is ended and you can start using it. So essentially to unlock it, is just double press and make sure it can see your face, which is super convenient and actually really quite fluent for this method. So I thought that this was pretty cool and that's basically how it works. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, definitely throw me a thumbs up. That helps me out a lot here at the channel. Oh, also, if you guys are curious about this wallpaper, I will leave the Twitter handle for the creator down in the description. This has been IDM and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Later.